Some growing frustrations among Central Ohio gun owners. This comes after Columbus City Council's latest amendment to its newly passed gun restrictions. The city is giving people who own 30 or more round magazines until July 1st to properly dispose of them without being prosecuted. NBC 4's Anna Hoffman is live at City Hall with the details. Anna. Jen and Jared, city leaders are calling this a grace period. They say their goal is to help curb violence in the city, but some legal gun owners are saying they feel like they're being made into criminals. July 1st, that's the deadline Columbus City leaders are giving to legal gun owners. The legislation that just passed council gives the individuals who currently own high capacity clips a grace period uh, to turn in those high capacity clips in a, either to police or to sell them legally. This amendment passed by Columbus City Council is relating to their ban on 30 or more round magazines in city limits. This is an affirmative step to draw a line in the sand of protecting Second Amendment rights. This has never been an, an effort to have a gotcha moment for someone who may currently own these clips. However, local gun range owner Eric Delbert says he feels differently. Law-abiding people are now, by the mere stroke of a pen, a criminal for something and they've never done anything, have no intentions to doing anything wrong. Delbert says since the amendment, he sent out a notice to customers telling them to bring their magazine rounds to his store. You can certainly drop them off here. We will put your name on it. We will st uh, stick them aside. Delbert also says he still firmly believes the difference between 29 rounds and 30 rounds will not stop crime in Columbus. Some of this uh, is admittedly tongue in cheek, but because city council and they are purportedly the experts in this, because they said 30 rounds is obviously the cutoff for being bad, we've come out with a product that will limit your, your magazine to 29 rounds. We put it with that in there. It's taller. Yep, it's taller, so it only limits it to 29 rounds. 29. The capacity of it has nothing to do with the intent or the criminal intent of the person. This is a, a step where we want to protect the Second Amendment protect responsible gun owners. City Attorney Zach Klein says people can drop off those high capacity magazines at any CPD substation or you can call his office and they will direct you to the right place. Local for you in Columbus, I'm Anna Hoffman, NBC4.